Here we're looking at the Dow, and we are seeing prices starting to accelerate a little bit here. Uh, and uh, we talked about this fact that it wasn't able to really break over this 18,000. This was our target range. Uh, we were shy of that, hitting the uh, the high of 17, um, 17,900. And prices just could not even exceed that range. And we said that was very that was our target range for some time. And we said that we really needed to uh, break that. And when we saw this rally back, we also talked about this gasping to the new high here and it possibly could extend there we said if it had some momentum and we really haven't been seeing that look at the momentum here we're very close to the prior highs this is legitimate dis, uh, divergence taking place and now we see this very accelerated move I think we'll see further action and if it takes out this um, 17200 level um, I think you'll see a much deeper move easily into the 50% retracement around this 16,850, if not much deeper, probably 16,500. Uh, and, uh, you know, of course, you'll see some bounces along the way here, but this could really start to turn over the entire marketplace if it starts to continue to accelerate, especially if it takes out these 1,600 levels, 16,000 level. If it takes that out, I think we go much lower, um, you know, potentially into um, the 15,000 range or, you know, again, even lower than that, probably longer term. But uh, traders need to watch uh, careful here that, uh, you know, they... Uh, this could start to accelerate a little bit. Um, on the short term, uh, we may see a little bit of a counter move as it tries to come into the prior support level with the 50-day moving average in this range, but I still think it's spelling trouble regardless if it bounces. I think you know, people take advantage of that bounce and try to sell into that um, or uh, move out of positions one way or another. But um, I do think that we're seeing some very negative action in this overall market that I think could only get worse from here, in, in my opinion. Um, and until we break 18,000 with some significant momentum, I am not um, uh, bullish on this marketplace.